Last time on The Walking Dead. Since I can remember, Clem's always been there with me. She taught me to be careful, to be quiet, to be strong, to save the last bullet for myself. To atone when I did something bad. To show mercy, sometimes. I always listen to Clem. Always. But I've been thinking more. I don't know if she's right every time. She told me to shoot her if she got bit. That doesn't feel right. We're doing a lot of bad things. To save our friends. To protect our home. But when Clem told me not to shoot Lily, and she... She killed James. I got mad. So mad. I don't... I don't know what I feel anymore. I don't know if Clem knows either. But I remember all the rules. And the first one... is never go alone. much longer. Here we go. Come on, Clem.
got something! Where do you think you're going? Find peace. Sorry about your tongue, but at least you're still alive. You have no idea how happy I am to see you right now. Get the fuck off of me! Are you okay? 
Yeah, my ass is a little singed, but I'm good. Fuck. You, I was, I was so afraid you. Me too, but we're okay. We're both okay. Lou. What happened to Minnie? I don't know. I lost track after the explosion. Flim! walkers than I can count. The explosion drew them right to us. Stay cool. We knew this would happen. We just have to get off this beach. Look! We brought the cart around. <laughs> Ruby! Willie! Come on! We're getting out of here! There's no end to these little shits! Put them down! Do something! Side. Damn right. AJ, go with him. No, I'm staying with you. Thanks, kiddo.
monsters. We need to move. We'll have to squeeze through there. We don't know where it goes. Well, we do know there's walkers in the other direction. But... Move it, dummy! in here. This sucks. This really fucking sucks. I'll figure something out. Hmm. Perfect. Flint. I need something to burn. safe. There's too much danger outside. I wish I had a gun. We'll be out of here soon. Hmm. Can't burn this without something to hold it up. Another one. Hmm. Gotta get home before AJ can play with it. No way we're swimming through that. Clem, did you... did you see Minnie out there? I didn't see her anywhere. But that doesn't mean she escaped. I don't know. I saw her on the beach. She was bitten, Ten. So, she'll go to the next place with Sophie. They can be together. That's good. over there. It's too far. Well, we just gotta... We gotta find something to help us cross. Clem, the walkers are getting closer. Don't worry. We'll be home before you know it. Might look nice in our room. Just have to get home first. Hmm, too far for us to jump across. Must be something we can use as a bridge. Hmm, rocks are too small to walk across. But they might stop something flowing down river. Not sure where it goes, but it's our only option. Clem, do you think James might wash down here? I'm not sure. I hope he done. I don't want to see him like that. If I yank that out of there, it would drift down the river and get caught in the rocks. Could work as a bridge. Okay. 
We just need to go across one by one, and then we'll move the rocks out of the way. And then I'll take... Where do we go? Ten, do you see a light down any of these tunnels? AJ, still with me? AJ, please. We have to keep moving. There's... There's nothing after this. What? James isn't in there. He looked right at me, and... and his eyes were empty. There's nothing after we die. Nothing but empty eyes. I know. I know you do. And I know you keep things from me. What? Away. Everything is just just wrong. Like something spilled on the floor and you just can't get it back. Because you didn't let me shoot her. AJ, every time you kill, you become a little harder. I'm scared of what you might become. Murdering Marlin was the start for you. I wanted to keep you safe from all this. I wanted to guide keep you. Keep me safe! You say don't be soft, but everything that you do just messes up my head. Be strong, be brave, and if I can't stop the bad people from killing me, kill myself first. <sighs> AJ. When we were talking with Abel, you stabbed him and stopped him from becoming a monster. You made killing look so easy. You killed those guys when we were sneaking on the boat. You didn't have to, but you did. What made him different from Lily? AJ, please, that's enough. I'm sorry. 
I'm just scared something will take you away. Aren't you scared of that too? Having to leave the world behind? And me? Listen, kiddo. Everyone is scared of dying. Of what happens after. Especially if it's nothing. people I care about to leave, Clem. I have to kill anyone that tries to take them away. I do. I believed you when you called me a murderer about Marlin. I don't think that murder means the same thing as it did when you were little. In a world that's gone now. I think the murder now is just protecting the people around you. Murder is a thing that makes us safe. I feel like I steered you wrong, AJ. If that's what you believe, I failed you. I don't think so, Clem. I think you helped me figure this out. I know you want to be big for everyone, but... You're just a kid, like me. Sometimes you're scared, just like any other kid. So I'll help. You said all the policemen and firefighters died. So I'm gonna be a new one. Even if I don't get it just right, I am. Because all it means is killing bad people who hurt other people. And I'm good at that. Like, I think I could be the best at killing bad people. Better than you, even. Because I wouldn't hesitate. AJ, I'm starting to believe that you like it. The killing. The power of it. No, I don't. It gives me nightmares, and it makes me breathe funny any time I have to do it. But I like making things feel safe for everybody. I need you to trust me, Clem. That I can tell the good people and the bad people apart. That I know when to use my gun. And that you'll let me decide for my own. Okay. Really? Firefighters have to make the hard calls, which means they deserve our trust. And if they kill to protect others, they're never happy about it. Killing people doesn't make me happy, Clem. Feel that? Yeah, that's the way out. Come on. Coast is clear. If the shore is that way, then the school is probably that way. A sim was the third. Huh? The day after AJ killed Marlon, you already know Violet and I voted for you to stay. A sim was the third vote. Wait, that means 
Omar voted us out? And Ruby? Uh, yeah. Huh. What made you think of that? Asim said you knew how to survive. He could just tell the school would be safer with you there. I voted for you because I liked you. But his reason, it was better. I just, I just thought you should know. Asim was right. We were safer. We were more scared than we let on when you met us. You made that go away. As bad as Marlin was, he still saved me and AJ. And you nursed me back to health. We owed you for that. Maybe, but even so. If Marlin was still in charge, we'd be taken away to wherever. Or dead. Instead, we fought back. Because you showed us how. We weren't safe with Marlin. Even in his safe zone. We were just... Hiding. Huh? Violet! You made it. You're all alive. I couldn't believe you were really dead. I had to try and find you. You did find me. Did everyone else escape? Yeah, they're okay. They took the cart and headed back to the school. We're safe, Clem. All we gotta do now is find our way home. Any idea which way that is? I know an old bridge near here. If we cross it, we won't be too far from the school. Well, we were looking for you guys, and I... I thought you might be... gone for good. Oh. Shit. I was trying to figure out what I'd do if you were gone. And I realized how goddamn stupid I was about Minnie. For a whole fucking year. I was so wrapped up in losing her and Sophie, I pushed away everyone who tried to care about me. Marlon, Brody, Lewis, even you and AJ, I, I, I tried my damnedest not to care about either of you. And I still couldn't tell you why. I know where you're coming from. After losing so many people, sometimes it's easier to keep everyone at arm's length. And then you wonder why you fight so hard to stay alive. I don't wonder anymore. Jesus, everything's so different now. Me, us, the school. I remember how Marlon described it, what we were gonna turn Erickson into. It's not the way any of us pictured it. How did you picture it? I guess I couldn't. I just listened to what Marlin said. How it would be a home. A real one, but I couldn't really wrap my head around it. My family lived in a trailer. Mm, what about you? Where'd you live? I lived in a house with my mom and dad. Fence around it, big backyard. What was your favorite part of the house? I 
had a treehouse in the backyard. I used to take my walkie-talkie up there and play for hours. I'd pretend it was a ship and I was the pirate captain, or it was an igloo and I was a hunter. <laughs> or a castle and I was a princess. Really? Like with frilly dresses and a tiara? Yeah, but also a sword. A warrior princess. Yeah, obviously. And that treehouse kept me alive when all this started. That's where I hid. <sighs> you know, Erickson can still be the home Marlin promised. As soon as we get back, we'll start rebuilding. Hmm. <sighs> It'll be a lot of work, but you're right. It is worth it. Hell, we could even put in a treehouse. We've already got a bell tower. Okay, we'll build a bell tower house. Perfect. After all that's happened, it's still hard to imagine. I mean, we fought for it. Defended it. It should feel more like home than ever, but it doesn't. You know what the problem is? That stupid fucking name, Erickson. You want to rename it? <laughs> yeah, fuck that guy. We should name it something cool. Threatening, but not like scary. Something that makes assholes go, I should stay away. But not like Blood Murder Knife House. You name it. It was your idea. Texas. We're calling it Texas. You can't just name it Texas. Fine. Texas too. I want to help rebuild our school. You will attend. We all will. We can start as soon as we get back. Let's get home to Texas, too. Okay, just take your time and keep moving forward. That's far. Really far. Should be able to jump it. It's not that far. Yeah, I think we can. We just gotta be careful not to land too hard. Dying. 
Yes. Yes, I am. I'm finally going someplace better. I want you there with me. Where everyone gets to be a person again. We're gonna go be with Mom and Dad and Sophie together. It won't be real if you're not there. Ten, look at me. I know that looks like her, but your sister is gone. I'm... Don't you fucking speak to him! Any of you! Do this! Don't worry, Ten. She can try to stop me. But I am not going anywhere without you. The night will be over soon. your life, I. You'd be dead if he hadn't taken that shot. You think that's okay? Just gunning down one of our own. I didn't want to shoot him. He was my first real friend. 
But he was messing up again, just like when he got Mitch killed. So I had to decide. Clem said I could, so I did. Goodbye, Tom. it. We can't stay here. Keep moving forward. Keep moving forward. Keep moving. Keep moving forward.
Hey, I love you. Don't ever forget that. I love you too, Clem. Keep moving forward. Look! James's barn! It's empty now. We'll be safe in there.
Paige, you... You did it. Now what? You need to find a way out of here. We could climb up there. The monsters can't reach us up there. Let's go. Easy climb. Come on. Please. Try. You can't give up. You can't give up. I need you. I need you. You don't need me. Not anymore. Look what you did. All by yourself. <laughs> My little goofball. It's Alvin Jr. You'll always be goofball to me. Hey, look at me. Hey, Jay, please. You're such a cutie. How did I get so lucky? Silly right now. Not right now. Please. I just wanted to see you smile. One last time. Don't say that. Please. Don't say that. I need to make sure you remember. Remember what? The rules. What's number one? Never go alone. So, so I can't leave. Not without you. AJ. It's your rule. You won't be alone. Not for long. Get back to the school. I don't know how. Sure you do. One of the first things I ever taught you. You need to make sure they can't smell you, so... Fresh, juicy walker just waiting to be gutted. Grab that axe. You know what to do with it. Next rule. What do we do when the monsters come? Clem. AJ. Shoot them in the head. Got any more ammo? There isn't any more. <sighs> okay then. Fuck. And the last rule. I want to stay with you. I know what'll happen. And I don't care. I don't want to go. I just want to sit next to you and... and... stay. Like that monster couple from the train station. Even if someone kills us later, we'll just sit for a really long time. Please. Let me stay. Oh, sorry, kid. But no. I have a job for you. I need you to get back to your room. I need you to sleep in your bed and have friends and grow tall. Taller than I ever was, I hope. I need you to live, AJ. For me. 
that's your job now. Okay, Clem. That's my job. Last rule. No. What do we do if I get bit? <laughs> Are you going to make me say it? Why? Hey, Jane. You have to kill me. Don't let me become one of them. Be a good boy. I'm coming. Years old. His name's Alvin Jr.
soon. I've just got to grab a few things. Just a few more things and we'll leave. Go back to Richmond. This whole area is a war zone. Gotta... Go? Yeah, we have to go, AJ. This place, we can't stay here. It's not safe. But it's okay. We're survivors. And the first rule of survival is... Never go alone. 
never go alone. Clem? <laughs> yeah, that's right. AJ? I've really missed you. So much. I know where we'll go. We'll go find ourselves a new home. Together. And I'll never leave you again. Gotcha. <laughs> Who's a good girl? Is you, Rosie? Goodest girl in the world. There we go. All right, girl. I'm gonna go put this beer away. Stay here and keep watch. Nothing good. Beds are pretty good. Better than the ground. This place is... C cursed. Oh, that's scary. And mean. I think this place is good. I should tell Willie this is here in case we need more bombs. V plus M. Violet plus Minnie. She used to be their friend. How can someone just make that go away? Looks like a bad place to sleep. It's getting kind of cold. I'll bring some sticks and stuff next time.
No. No, no! Yes! Good girl! I'm sorry, Tim, but you were going to get Violet killed. I had to do it. I hear you, girl. I hear you. Goodbye, Tin. Hey, hun. It's getting late. Just coming to check on you. Dinner soon. Okay. I'm all done anyway. That's a good scratching spot. I think it is. Oh, wow. You found her hat. It found me. Okay, hon. Um, I'm gonna go check on a sim over at the rabbit traps. Let's go home. <laughs> Let's go home. i 
strength of water can sink a man. Take us back, oh, take us back, oh, take us, take us back. What you doing there, goofball? Whoa, <laughs> easy there. You're out of bed. You're walking. And, and you have wood arm legs. Crutches. Crutches. I found your hat. It was in the creek down by the shack. I thought I wouldn't get it, but Rosie jumped right in and got it out of the water. It's all wet now. It's definitely seen better days. You know what? You keep it if you want it. I'll put it in our room. I have a surprise for you, too. Come with me. I want to show you something. So, what do you think? It's... it's for me? Yep. Willie helped me put it together. Come on, let me push you. <laughs> did you ever get to swing when you were smaller? Yep, sure did. A long time ago. Food's ready, everyone! Come and get it! You're the best, Clem. It's gonna get cold! Come on, let's go eat. We're coming!
Already? You even taste that? Yeah, that's the spot. A sim says he saw 10, 15 of them, a little bit past the old safe zone. I want you to go. You're the boss. We need to know who they are. Maybe even see if they're willing to trade. Just keep your distance until you can make a call. Who who are? A group of survivors out beyond the old safe zone. Some kind of caravan. Are they bad people? How about you back me up, and we'll find that out together. Word on the street is you're a good running buddy. Best. Uh, aren't you still mad I killed him? The thing you said on the bridge. That he was messing up all the time. It wasn't something new, you know. Ten got himself or other people into trouble all the time, long before you guys got here. He was always so lost. He lived in a world that just isn't there, you know? And that's why I tried to look after him. But when I was pulling him away from the walkers and Mini, I could also see he just wasn't there anymore. So you're mad, but sad. Can I be that for a while? Yeah, it's okay. This is the part where you tell me you'll be really, really careful. <sighs> you okay? Just... just getting tired. Hey, walk with me a sec. Gotcha. Uh, sorry. <laughs> it's okay. I stare at it too. If it was just you and me alone out there, and I was like this, I don't know if I'd make it two weeks. I'm gonna need these to go anywhere. And if we ever had to run... It wouldn't be pretty. You made it so we don't have to run, Clem. We're safe now. Yeah, I guess we are. <laughs> All this. It's worth it. All those times you would ask me if we'd find a home. All I could ever tell you was, we'll see. And your face would fall every single time. It's better than saying yes and lying to me. And that's what I told myself. But you want to know something I didn't tell you? I never had a plan. I never knew where we were going. I never knew anything. I just fought and fought and fought and hoped you didn't notice. Hoped we'd find something before you did. Did I do a good job? Of course you did. What are you... are you crazy? <laughs> Maybe a little. A lot more than a little. When we were in the barn, you didn't listen to me. 
And if you had, I'd be dead. I was right to trust you, back in the cave. To make the hard calls, even when I couldn't. You'll have to be strong for the both of us. You made it so I can. So, thank you. For everything. You're welcome, for everything. Okay, okay, in you go. That looks like it tastes bad. I won't lick it. I won't. I wonder who you used to be. know how this works. This seems like really hard drawing. I'll ask Klim later. Still scary. Why did Klim collect so many skulls? Pretend this is you still watching out for us. I think you like that. I hope so, at least. Clem said she'd teach me to ride someday. I gotta get bigger, fast. This is a good one. Like it's protecting us. It's too bad he won't be able to draw another one. I hope you have extra crayons wherever you are, Tin. You know what? I'm a great artist. You hear me, Rosie? Oh, great. It's so cool looking. I wonder if it has magic powers. Nah. Never gonna die, huh? That's lucky. I can't reach. That's unfair.
Hey there, Alvin Jr. You ready to rock? So cool, Disco Broccoli. Like, the coolest. Even if I could eat you, I wouldn't do it. You're too cool. Clem never explained what is Disco. Oh, I'm just getting myself hungry. I wonder if you're hungry for bugs. They're dead. Bye, flowers. I'll pick some more. Go, Erickson! I still don't know why you say that. It's like Lewis in a box. Omar didn't want this back. He said, well, it didn't work, did it?
Just trying to unwind 